before this video start i want everybody to excuse my cables in the junkiness of my room it definitely could have been better but i appreciate everybody for stopping by let's get it Matt Games in the building and what's going on YouTube today we got another CyberPower PC video and in this video I'm upgrading my CPU which is a Ryzen 7 3800X to a 5800X and it's supposed to do about 20% increase in performance I see I definitely see a pretty big performance boost so yeah man it might be worth it man but yeah be sure to like comment and subscribe we dropping more bangs and I'll be showing showcasing how certain games play with this new CPU yes yeah Got the motherboard down. Well, we got the PC down. We also have our wrist wrapped. We're gonna clamp that to the metal part of there to ground us. Couldn't get a strap, so made my own. Basically, some aluminum foil around the rubber band with alligator clip connecting me to the PC metal part, the PC, so I can be grounded, so I don't short anything inside of the PC. Now, let's get this joint open. Like I said, I'm grounded to the box. I'm plugged in. We're also off. So, you want anybody short circuiting anything? So, we have the liquid cooler right there. What I'm trying to get to is the CPU, which is under the liquid cooler. So, what we have to do is take the whole liquid cooler part off. So, I probably have to take that off along with the fans, but hopefully, I can just take that off. We shall see. We got the regular Phillips screws in there. I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah, we gotta get that off. I think it's four of them, so we're gonna get those off. And we have to get a disconnect the fan. Look, the lighting is good enough to see it in here. Hold on, let's see. Boom, there we go. So, disconnect the fan part right there. So we can get that off as well. Let's get it. Tell you what, I had to unhook that. They show sure wrapped it around the liquid cooler. So let's get it off, bro. Sheesh. They wrapped it around the liquid cooler like a mug. Let's get that out. Pay no attention to my cords to the left. All of those came out of the PC, so. Yeah. Make sure you keep note of where you got these things from. Do you wrap it around the PC as well? Awkward. Anyway, let's start unscrewing. Like I said, I'm grounded to the box. I'm plugged in. And we're also off. So, you want anybody short circuiting anything or messing up any pieces inside of the computer? And the best thing to do would be to use the rubber. They make it themselves. The ground strap thingies, they make them themselves. But I couldn't find one, so I had to make it myself. We shall be okay. Well, basically, I got to get all four of these screws out. Let me do that. So we got it up. The wires right here. those off and the chip is stuck to the bottom of the cooler so we gotta get that off as well yeah okay so took a while because this cpu was actually well the 3700 that i'm replacing or 3600 whatever it is that i'm replacing 3800x yeah the 3800x i'm replacing was kind of stuck to the bottom of the cooler as you can see but um, yeah, we took a while, but we had to pry it off. Well, not really pry it, but we had to do this to get it off. Now, we're gonna clean this off and clean that off so we can apply some new thermal paste. And yeah, put the new chip in. Yeah, yeah, hold on. Put a new chip in. Get the brand new one out, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Now, ideally, ideally, you want to take this completely off, 
but that wire i don't know where it's hooking to but i cannot get it off that's wild that's a wild statement but yeah i can't remove it so i'm gonna have to leave that on so let's take this out of the wrapping yeah. well, you put it on there hey. oh wow that's wild that's wild don't do what i just did but you want to make sure there's no bent pins or anything mine looks pretty good and as you can see that up top that's an indicator there's other people videos that explain this way better this is basically just me upgrading mine but the indicator is top left i don't know if you guys can see that hold on the indicator is right there on this one so with that in mind we lift this that in mind we lift that and basically drop this in wait arrow to arrow sheesh i'm tweaking arrow to arrow good god boom drops right in once you get it dropped right in see that oh now clamp it down boom heard the click pop Yes, sir. Ooh, it's in there all shinier. Now, we gotta put some thermal paste. Let's get it. Now, we got our thermal paste. Jesus Christ, I almost dropped it. Got our thermal paste. Got this from Best Buy today. Got the high performance of this one a little thicker than the other one I got. And we just gonna put a pea size drop on there. Wait, hold on. We gotta clean off the old paste from the cooler. Definitely got to clean the old paste off of the cooler. All righty, let's do that first. Wow. Now that I've cleaned the tool for it, I'm cleaning the thermal paste from that. I'm gonna put a pea size amount right in the middle. Don't want to put too much. But you also don't want to put too little. That should be good enough. <clears throat> right there. I'd be worried that I don't got enough, low key. But that should be good. Don't get that off of there. Let me push that back down. Get that out of the way. Push this back down. The way it was. A lot of people like to spread it too. At this point, they be spreading it themselves, so they could get a good joint in there. Oh yeah, that's that's good. That's a good spread. That's a good spread. Nice good spread. Now we gotta screw everything back on. So we finally got it in. AMD Ryzen 7 5800X 8 core processor took longer than needed, which is 100% my fault. But yes, sir, we got that 5800X in here with the 3060. We finna kill it.